Hello and welcome to the Ed Hoddle Show presented by Buffalo Wild Wings. I'm Greg Royce, joined by Stevenson football coach Ed Hoddle. Coach, you were back on the road last week. You go up to Lebanon Valley. Um, kind of a tight game for a while. Second half, you were able to pull away and come away with the, uh, your fifth straight victory. It was nice. You know, the, it was a physical football game. Uh, we expected that going in, and our guys did a nice job responding. Um, I think we were able to execute the game plan, and, and it became more and more evident as we went through the course of the game. Um, guys responded well to adjustments. You know, really a good overall effort getting the two block punts, getting yeah. some explosive plays on teams, um, you know, holding, uh, you know, a pretty formidable running game, you know, to run about 100 yards was, was certainly significant for us. And then obviously being able to move the ball offensively was good to see. Yeah. I think that's the most exciting part that when you may have successes, the balance that you have both defensively and offensively, you're not relying like, oh, we've got to have the defense limit them or we've got to have the offense score 50 points in order to win. Like, there's that nice balance, I think. Like you said, with special teams too coming in this week and making a couple of big plays as well. It's nice, and I think that's really kind of who we are as a, as a program now, which is really, really good. It's not, you know, you, you look at our running back situation. You, yeah. you look at the receiving core. You look at the, the distribution of tackles on the defensive side. Yeah. And, you know, it really is a team effort, and I think that's been a, a big emphasis of ours throughout the course of the year. And it's nice to see it kind of playing out, you know, even on the stat sheet. And it's leading to wins, which is obviously the most important statistic. Right, absolutely. On the offensive side, uh, Chaz Lyles, the last couple of weeks, he's had a couple of big games offensively. You know, many of those big three seniors, but uh, Chaz, the last couple of weeks, you know, with the yardage and some of the big plays that him and Ryan have been able to hook up with. Yeah, it's no surprise with Chaz. I, I mean, his work ethic is something that is unparalleled. You know, yeah. he comes out to practice and, you know, he's 100 miles an hour from the first rep to the last rep. And, you know, very methodical, uh, very cerebral, understands what we're trying to do. Um, couple that with with the, the, his effort and his willingness to, to give 110% on every play is, is, is quite extraordinary. Yeah, absolutely. And like you said, it's not like teams can necessarily just key on him because if they do, you've got a couple other guys that can hurt you and as well as your running game. Yeah, I'm excited that we don't have to defend our offense, I can tell you that. <laughs> um, no, we, we like being multiple. Um, it's something that I know that, 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 that we emphasize. And, you know, having, you know, three running backs, I, I think we've had – three guys go over 100 yards at various points throughout the season. And, um, you know, in the receiving core, you know, that group of seniors, they've all had a, a big day here, a big yeah. day there. And and so you know, the distribution of the football is something that, that we think, you know, helps us helps us be successful. Yeah, absolutely. That yeah, shifting gears so uh, this week, and uh, we talked a little bit uh, last week, played meaningful football games in November. And certainly this is a meaningful football game in November. You head up to Wilkes. Uh, tied for second in the conference right now, and obviously a big game in terms of uh, you know bowl position. Sure, they're they're all big this time of year. Right. You know, for us, it's and again, it's it's the focus on being the best football team that we can be. Um, you know, I'm excited to get get back on the road again. You know, for us, it's you know I think our guys are pretty comfortable traveling. Yeah. So um, you know whether we're here, whether we're there, it really doesn't matter. We've got to go out and and put our best football on film, and you know hopefully be able to you know be successful. Yeah. Absolutely. All right, Coach, we wish you the best of luck on the road this week, and I will chat next week. Thanks, Greg. All right, for Ed Hoddle, I'm Greg Royce. This has been the Ed Hoddle Show.